property immediately and failure to do so may result in fines, arrest, and prosecution. Persons disturbing, moving, or removing any structures or other items outside of the immediately fenced line of this property or making any alterations to the property, such as erecting structures, will be subject to arrest and prosecution. You're not making a structure, because that was your number one complaint was building structures, but if they have no plan to erect structures, is that okay? Because that's not what they're here for. They're not here to make a building. No, they're trespassing. What constitutes trespassing on a plot of land that has no proper fence? Is that trespassing to stand in that lot without any tools in my hand? Is it trespassing if I don't work the lot? So if I just stand in the lot, can I do that? I did last night. Hey, maybe you don't even know. If I stand in that lot, am I a trespasser and will I be arrested? If I stand in that lot, will I be a trespasser? Will I be arrested? What are the rules? Sometimes the UC just vaguely says stuff like, oh, you're all criminals, you're all going to be arrested. But when it comes down to the actual details, can you specify how Occupy is a danger to the community? Because you said that earlier, that Occupy endangers the community. You need staff working. And the Chancellor of the University of California at Berkeley. This mixed-use property is owned by the Regents of the University of California and is not open to the public. Persons entering or remaining on this property without permission from the Regents of the University of California are trespassing and in violation of 602 of the California Penal Code. You are ordered to leave the property immediately and failure to do so may result in fines, arrest, and prosecution. Persons disturbing, moving, or removing any structures or other items outside of the immediate area of this property or making any alterations to the property, such as erect, erecting structures, will be subject to arrest and prosecution. Is that the UC's road? You don't even know. You don't even know what the laws are. You don't know if anyone's breaking any rules. You don't even know. This is a serious question. Is this road you see pro You might know because you work with the council. Anyone here work with the council? Does this road that I'm standing on belong to the UC? You can't even answer that because you don't even know. Do you know? Do you know if I'm standing on UC property right now? You have no clue. You have absolutely no clue if I'm standing on UC property right now. So you're telling everyone that they're criminals and they're violating the law, but when asked to define what the rules and the boundaries are, you don't know, you don't know, you don't know. She doesn't know. She's leaving. She's just given up. He doesn't know, even though he's wearing a Cal shirt, the blue and gold. You obviously represent Cal, but you can't tell me if I'm standing on UC property or not, because you don't know. Huh. You don't know, even though you're a counter-protester who says that people are invading, but you can't even define the property that they're invading. So when it comes to arrest these people, how do you decide who violated the law? You don't know. Without the permission of the regents of the University of California are trespassing alterations to the property, such as erecting structure structures in the property immediately, and failure to do so may result in fines, arrest, and prosecution. Persons disturbing, moving, or moving or removing any structures. Or one. You want to be right there? Sure. No problem. So I'm not trespassing. Where are you going? Be right there on the sidewalk or on the street? Sure, you're fine.